Hey awesome nursing students, today we are diving into a topic that's super common and super testable on the NCLEX, asthma. And no, you don't need an inhaler for this video, but you might need a notebook. Let's go. So what is happening during an asthma attack? The airway gets inflamed, the muscles around the airway tighten, and lots of mucus shows up uninvited. Seriously rude, right? This makes it super hard for patients to breathe. And you might hear a wheezing sound, kind of like a tea kettle on the stove but way more dangerous key and click tip number one wheezing is airways are tightening always listen for wheezing because it's one of the first signs that asthma is getting worse so what do we do about it we need to open up those airways fast and quick first line treatment for an asthma attack is short acting bronchodilators like albuterol think this way a for asthma, A for albuterol. Key and clicks tip number two. Albuterol is rescue inhaler. It's the first medication you give during an active asthma attack. Now, after we open the airway, it's time to calm that inflammation down. That's where corticosteroids like prednisone come in. But remember, steroids take hours to work, not minutes. So albuterol first, steroid second always remember this order key and click tip number three corticosteroids are not for emergency relief they are for long-term inflammation control and here is quick checklist to remember for asthma in order to answer all type of NCLEX questions rescue inhaler albuterol first long-term control corticosteroids and always listen for wheezing. Remember to teach patients to use a spacer with inhalers because it helps the medication go deeper into the lungs. And also peak flow meter readings show how well their lungs are doing. And also wanted to mention this, asthma may be tricky, but remember you are smarter. With these tips, you are ready to crush any NCLEX asthma questions that comes your way. Stay amazing, keep studying smart, and I'll see you in the next video. You've got this.